Oh. Oh, and gets it through extra cover. Long chase for Broad. Ball wins. Yeah, I'm sure it does. We're going to have a look at this and uh, just hope somebody might just put the boundary back. For Oh, another Google, it's short leg. Wow, he's taking a blow there, Johnny Bairstow. Gracious. Nicely driven. It's going to beat that fielder and would also win the race. He's going to try and get it up there. He wants to see if he can get any swing with this new ball that really hasn't been much all day or any real sign of it all day. It's a nicely controlled shot. Oh, is that dropped? Is that the third time today a chance has gone? That's Ian Bell. Oh, my God. Well, straightforward outside edge. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. That's two pretty simple catches put down. Oh, England, make it hard for yourselves. Why don't you? Well, slider down the leg side gets a tickle. Just awaiting the keeper. The strangle down the leg side. What thought he was in with a chance. Through mid on. And the vain chase for Alistair Cook, who's not at slip. He's at mid on, he split his webbing last evening, so Joe Root is at slip. Very good through the onside as a Shafiq. Good balance and just bisects that gap perfectly. Much stronger on the onside as a Shafiq. And if you bowl him there. Cut! Oh, it's through. In the air for a while, very flat. Mid off, mid on up. Nasir Shafiq wouldn't like that. Back himself to clear them. Didn't get all of it towards the bottom of the bat. Slightly lucky, but the intent was always there. That's well connected. That really is muscled over mid on for a four. As mentioned earlier, not an easy angle to execute, but have a look at this uh, use of the foot and uh, just opening himself and hitting it against the spin over long on. So Finn is out, unfortunately, because of uh, a bone stress injury to his left foot. And Look to bowl within the stumps. I think Pakistani faster men will do the same. That's put away into the gap. He's been rather severe off the back foot against the leg spinner. That's not the first time he's carved a, a four through the offside. The balance was good. Just stayed into the shot. Ball keeping a touch low, but uh, that didn't make the batsman hesitate at all. Extravagant spin from Adil Rashid, but that also allowed Asad Shafiq with an extra bit of width. In fact, it's quite similar. This time, the ball will race away to the boundary. 
Braxton Small, I remember, had a real no-ball problem as well. You had one as coach, didn't you? Dean Headley out in the Caribbean. No ball. <laughs> I remember, it, I think it was a series against Sri Lanka where the umpires actually were not reading him properly and so he would call out loudly before delivering a ball. It's a googly, <laughs> just to let them know that if it hits the pad, then they should raise the finger. That's beautifully done through the offside. He's such a good player against Spinner and there's an example of that. Uh, it's not the best delivery that's been bowled today. Drag down short and wide, but put away. Will that reach the boundary? If it does, it's going to be a hundred for us at Shafiq, and yes, it touches the rope. Another moment where the dressing room would stand up. There they are. What a knock from Asad Shafiq. Well, it's records all the way for Pakistan. Both batsmen with memorable moments. A double hundred for Shoaib Malik. And now Asad Shafiq gets to 100. Wasn't originally selected in this game. That's the way to do it. 10 fours. If you look at Yasser Shah, his, his entire body and, and, and arms and wrists are involved in delivering a ball. That's gone and hit the fence. A leg by. Yeah! Well, another appeal and he's given him. England have got a wicket. Hold the back page. It's official, England have got a wicket. Sheffield has to go, but for a well played 107.